everyone, welcome to C3 Kids. Hope you've had a great week. Are you ready for our memory verse? Let's go. We have everything we need to live a life that pleases God. 2 Peter 1, 3. How did you go? Shall we try it again? We have everything we need to live a life that pleases God. 2 Peter 1, 3. I think we've got it now. Shall we head to our story? Hello boys and girls. I'm glad you could join us for our story today. You remember we're learning about the fruits of the Spirit? We've got our poster over here to, to remind us. So first we learn about love, didn't we? And then we, last week, Renee told a story about kindness and about how some friends lowered someone through a roof to Jesus, didn't they? I'm just going to pop these on our poster. Today, we're going to learn about kindness with a story called The Good Samaritan. And Je this was Jesus' way of showing people how to be kind to others. And the story goes like this. Once there was a man who was on his way to a faraway town. He was walking along the road and he was attacked by some bad guys who beat him up and left him lying on the ground. Poor Ted. Then along came a traveler he was pretending to do the right thing. He saw the man lying on the side of the road and thought, mm, I'm just going to pretend I didn't see that. And he walked right on past and left the man lying beside the road. Then another traveller came along. He saw the man lying there too and thought, Gee, he doesn't look very good. But he decided not to stop. He was very busy. So he kept going and left him lying there. And then a third traveller came along the road. He saw the man. He knew that he was hurt badly and he stopped. And he washed his wounds, sat him up, put him on a donkey and took him. We're going to wrap him up in a blanket, make him comfortable. And he took him to the nearest hotel and paid the manager at the hotel some money to look after him. And then he said, if he doesn't get better soon, if you need more money, I'll pay you next time I see you. After Jesus had told that story, he asked the his friends, who do you think showed kindness? And I think we know who did, don't we, in that story. It was the third man. We call him the Good Samaritan because he came from Samaria. At the end of that story, Jesus said to the crowd, go and do the same as he did. So this week, I want you to think about how you can show kindness to other people. It might be someone in your family, uh, might even be one of your pets at home. Let's pray. Lord, we thank you that you want us to have a great life, that you've got great plans for us. We thank you that you show kindness to us and that we can show kindness to others. And we pray that this week we'll think of things that we can do to show kindness to other people. Amen. Thanks for joining us today. And thanks for listening. Have a great week. Bye. Hey kids, can you remember all the fruits of the spirit? Let's go through them. Ready? We've got love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, gentleness, faithfulness, and self-control. Let's see if you can remember them for next time. 
How good was that? I loved it. Hope you did too. See you next time.